Today, we're going to try and see if we can survive the Monaco Grand Prix with extreme hardcore damage, but not on the F1 23 game. We're rewinding 10 whole years back to F1 2013. This was the first ever game I did a Survive episode on. We started the entire idea of the Survive series on this channel with Survive Monaco on F1 2013. And so I thought, 10 years later, let's throw it back. Let's throw it an anniversary party. And let's go back to this game. We've got the original Hardcore Damage mod for F1 2013. But the difference is, back when I started this series, I did it on a controller. So I'm making it now a bit harder for myself. We're going to be doing it, as we have done on the modern F1 games, with a keyboard to try and see if we can survive one whole lap without breaking any bit of our car. Anything comes off, we have to re start. And the big thing is, on these older F1 games, the AI are just so much worse. They can't race clean, so there's going to be absolute carnage, I'm hoping. It feels so strange loading up the grid here, back on this game. Um, let me know in the comments below, do any of you, were any of you around 10 years ago, when I first uploaded that first Survive Monaco? If you are, you're an absolute legend, but I'll be very surprised if there is, but let's see. We're starting P11, usual Survive rules. Uh, that we've done in the modern takes. We have to try and get a P10 so we can't dawdle about as we go to fire red lights. Of course, we have to drive as my man, Jensen Button, back in the Vodafone Chrome McLaren. Easy does it. There's already quite a bit of carnage going on behind me. I heard a big thump. We've got Maldonado on the left and then we've got a red flag already. We've not even got through to the next part of the circuit. I was very worried about Maldonado being there, but the red Red flags out. They had red flags back it back in this game, and then we had such a large break until F123 to have them back. Right, red flag is well, it's already helped us out that much. We're, we're only one position higher in P10. There, there's only 17 runners now in this, so a few AI had a bit of a mare into turn one, but now I'm on the outside of the circuit. So how is this gonna fare? Easy does it! Oh my! What the <laughs> Look at the damage model on this Hulkenberg. A light tap and my front wing's off. The rear end exploded as well. The damage model on this game was so much more extreme, I feel. Like, you actually had the ability to have a rear wing fly off your car. Hulkenberg's actually decked it. I've actually got a puncher on the rear left there, and then look up further up the road. There's a crash going on uh, as we go up. Yeah, this is um already levels above what we have with the modern F1 games in terms of the AI are just so dumb. <laughs> it's actually so much harder on a, on a keyboard as well. Like, the Genuinely, keyboard driving on F123 has actually come a long way if, you, if you're one of the, well, I don't know, one people in the world that use a keyboard still to race on F1. It's a lot. <laughs> oh, no, no. Oh, come on. I did so well to avoid everything. And then that little side pod glitch on the Renault. On the Renault. All right, we go again. I've actually somehow finessed this because we started the, 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 the video in P11 and now it's just putting me on P8 on the grid now. So I've just permanently got a P8 spot from that red flag, I think, or whatever. But being on the outside here is not useful because there's always a car on my inside that could take me out. He's a oh, come on! Grosjean! It's literally one little love tap and the front wing's gone. And my sense of spatial awareness is just out the window. These cars are different dimensions. The way it turns on a keyboard is so different as well. There's a lot less weight but the braking also, the brake performance isn't as good. Easy. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh my God. That Salva has no front wing. We've just managed to avoid it. We're still good. We're in P9. This is where I had issues last time. Come on, turn. Easy. Ah, oh, ah, ah. The brake power is just not there. I actually can't dive it as well as I could on the modern games. We're still good, though. We're still good. We're still intact. This is. Oh, no. <laughs> That car's been destroyed. I need to be braking so much earlier. It's a 2013 F1 car. It just doesn't have 
the drag, the downforce of the modern cars. I need to be braking way earlier. And also the rear end stepping out quite a fair bit. So I'm sliding about even with full traction on with the keyboard. Yeah, oh my god, Alonso's got it all crossed up. Can we go around the outside? Yes, we can. There's a car on my inside, though. It's the Lotus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This isn't going to end well. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. sparks flying as Alonso squeezes out Mark Webber. We're trying to hold P8 here. Maybe go. Oh, no. Oh, come on, Webber. On, the, on F123, the acceleration is absolutely OP at the moment for us in my team career mode. But these guys just aren't getting out of the corner quick enough. Right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and get to the inside if I can. No, please, let me go to the inside. Or the middle. Oh, the middle. Oh, what a, what a dive. We've made it. We've made it. We actually made that double bars work. But now the Lotus was on my rear end. And there's no way to do auto deploy on curves. So I'm just losing pace with the curves deployment. As you can see in the bottom right. That, but. No, I actually can't drive. I can't drive on this game. No wonder I had a field day with survive on this game. We could make multiple survives every single circuit because it's so damn hard to control. It's not even just the AI that are actually just can't race each other. It's just so much harder to control your own car and avoid them. I feel like I'm going to hit a car every single time we get near to it, whereas I have so much more confidence in the more recent F1 games um, to put the car where I want it. Like, look at that. It's just sliding about. And then I tap the brakes and it just doesn't really work. Oh, there's a Mercedes front wing flying off as we dive down the inside of Felipe Massa. La oh, my. What the? <laughs> what happened there? What happened? Oh, my. How we haven't lost any bit of our car, I will never know. Oh, my days. Massa ricochets into me. And his front wing explodes. But our car is still intact. The heads up display did not come up. So that's... Oh, fuck! No! Are you okay? That looked heavy. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. I unpaused it. And I just went straight... That... <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. We did so well against Massa there. Okay. Note to self. The hairpin. Don't pause the game. Because we just get... Jump, we get put in straight into the action. And there's no time to even react to the fact we're unpausing. Right, we've got to the inside, which is good. Cheeky little dive here. Nice. Hit that apex. Nailed it. Up to P6. Side by side with Fernando Alonso. Going to stick to the right because he's still there. Okay, I've got him. I've got him. Easy. Easy. Good. Break a bit here. Good. Oh, my God. It's so shit on a keyboard. It's so bad. Oh, Webb has broken his front wing. It's so bad on a keyboard. I'm never going to complain about keyboard driving on the modern F1 games ever again. This is awful. Oh, red flag. Race has been stopped for what? I can't even... Oh, on the replay system. Oh, the replay system's so old. I can't even see what's happened. But on the mini-map, it just shows a cluster at Mirabeau. So I think something's happened at Mirabeau. Yep, three cars have been taken out. Right, well, we go again then. Um... We're up to P4. We could try and win. I think we should try and win this race, you know. I think we could I could think we could do it with a good enough start. Five red lights. On the way. Rosberg, we have a slow getaway. We're going to get to the right. Oh, get to the right of Hamilton. We made a little bit of a love tap on him. It's fine. I've got a car on my inside. I've avoided him. No, Hamilton! That was a big impact. Let me know you're okay. No, I'm not okay. I'm not. Are you even Jeff? Are you Jeff in this game still? I don't know when Jeff kicked in. Whoever that engineer is called, we're going to call him Jeff. I think that that's that was the northern Jeff. The engineer up till about, what, F1 2015 was like the northern Jeff. And then he became a bit more centralised in terms of his UK accent. Right, here we go. Can we squeeze through on my side? Ay, ay, ay. It's very close. How, how I've not lost any of my front wing there, I will never know. We're down to P10, though. We've been overtaken by a Sky Sports pundit. Can we try and go around the outside of him? Oh, no, we can't because there's no turning. You let off throttle and there's no turning. Absolutely. I've taken out my teammate with this and I've, I've created a massive pile up there. Oh, God. What's this? No, not this camera. Back to that one. Right. We're back down to... I don't, I don't get what the re... I'm clicking restart race. They're just putting me in random grid slots. I honestly think it's being done by where the hell they were in the last race being a Grand Prix mode. Right. Turn one's fine. We can navigate that well. I've understood that now. Oh, three wide ahead. That's not going to end well. Right. Um, I'm just going to stick behind Kimmy, to be honest, right now. I'm not going to try anything at this left-hander. Just really turn it in. 
Oh, you really have to turn. Ria and Massa! What was that, man? You just... <laughs> Sergio Perez flying about without a front wings jokes. Massa, though, just didn't even want to get out. He was, he was like too busy mesmerized by the casino, he was. All right, come on. This is the 10th anniversary. We should be showing all our class, all the knowledge we've gained of doing survives for 10 years should be coming into this video. And so far, it's not. I'm being die bombed by AI now. I'm actually getting slower. We're down to P... Oh, okay. We're down to P10. We cannot lose a single more position. Otherwise, we won't complete the challenge. But I need to first actually get to the end in one piece. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, around the outside. Oh, what a move. What a move. Oh, he's done it. Sensational stuff. On the inside of Paul Resta. Lovely. Two overtakes done. Up to P9. Da... Oh, come on. Where is the brake power? Gonna have to stop. I'm gonna have to start breaking at Catalonia for that hairpin, I think. We go again. Paul De Resta is um, moving across on me. Look at maybe looking to ruffle some feathers. There's three wide into turn one. Oh, there's a collision ahead of us. Oh, we've been hitting the rear. We've been hitting the rear. My heads up display's come up, so I've been hitting the rear. Uh, that's damage. That I've got to call that. I would love to continue, but I think I've got damage on the rear end because you can actually break your diffuser. On this game. Yep, they had diffuser damage on this game. I'm feeling good about this attempt. I think we can do this one. I think I think this, is, this might be it. This might be the end of the video on this run. I just have a good feeling it's not three wide anymore ahead of us. So that's calm. Easy. Oh, close. Oh, a lot of carbon fiber I can hear being hit. Oh, they've got a force in Yoma. Oh, red flag. Red flag. Look at the mini map. There's a lot of dots there at turn one. Hey! He crashed into me as we're on the red flags. That's not on. That's not on. We got underway again, though. Off the off the red flag. We're still P8 off the red flag. So we've not really gained much at all. Here we go again for the second time. In this, this, this counts as the same attempt, by the way. If there's a red flag involved, it's the same attempt. Okay, right. To the... Oh, I was going to say inside, but that's blocked off. Right. Easy. Oh, no! All right, so this is the last attempt. I'm feeling good about this one. We definitely didn't say that about the last one. Underway. Oh, it's a shocking getaway. A lot of wheel spin. A lot of wheel spin. Riken and slow. I don't like the way I'm tucked up behind Felipe Massa. Easy. Easy. No. No. Hold it. Hold it. Okay. Uh, Sauber's on my inside. No. 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 Oh. Someone's front wing came off. I'm actually... I forgot, actually. Remember the Sauber... Bloody hell. Bloody hell! I was going to say, those of you who do remember watching these ones, the Sauber, the Sauber team was always the one causing me problems in these Survive episodes. They were always the ones crashing into me. Them, that and the Caterhams, I think. On F120, was it 14, I think? Oh, he, oh my! Massa violently swung towards me! Massa, he Massa, uh, Massa's, uh, I'm having beef with Massa today. He's taken, he's, he's caused us an accident far too many times. Right, this is it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna absolutely dupe Massa here at the start. Come on. No, okay. That hasn't gone to plan. It's fine. I'm gonna overtake him at turn one. Watch this. Big dive, big dive, big. Oh, what a move. Uh, uh, um, okay. Um, we are going to, well, where is the position I have to hand back? Who? Who do I have to hand it back to? No, I get, I gave back all these positions and used to, ah, oh, come on. Oh, typical, typical survive. As we go on, the AI are just getting more and more reckless. I'm actually just making mistakes as well. Can we go around the outside of Mark Webber? No. Easy, easy. Slice this through here. Nice, okay. Got Hulkenberg, didn't get Webber. It's very difficult to get these guys because I think they're using their curves. And I, I just don't know what the button is for Kurz. And to be honest, I've got too much going on in my brain. Oh, 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 Weber's crash. <laughs> I nearly could have crashed into Rosberg. I was trying to make the move on Weber, and he's still there. I've got him, though. I've got him. Right, break now for the hairpin. Really early break zone for the hairpin is needed. I think we're good now. I think we're good. We just need to survive the rest of the circuit, and we will be good Oh my god, the turn in is abysmal. I just don't know where the car is going. It's like the keyboard doesn't even respond for like half a second and then it turns in. Right, break now. Nice. Oh, lovely. Good, good. Webb is helping me out behind me, I think. He's got... Oh no, Hulkenberg's overtaken him. He was helping me out with... No, no, no! 
I hate this game. I hate this game. No wonder I raged so much back in the day. Yeah, this is so much. I Compared to the modern game, compared to this, the last like three, four years of doing Survive on the more modern F1 games, they look like a piece of piss now. Because that, that was embarrassing. That was, I was all alone at Tabak, and that was simply just the lack of turning with this handling model and a keyboard. Right. We're back in a similar position, looking to overtake Mark Webber. We've still got the nose. Hey! I hate this. I hate this now. I hate this. Oh, just like 10 years ago, huh? Just like 10 years ago. Absolutely raging at this game, these AI, and this mod. Right. On the way. Gonna get to the inside here. It, no, no. Oh, bloody hell. Hulkenberg, he stopped that idea. Mass has put me wide. Oh, this is not good. Four wide ahead of us, lads. It's not going to work. Oh, God. We are way too close. Hey, God! I knew I was way too close to Raikkonen. I just knew it. And we got a puncher. Great. Okay. This time, get to the inside. Get to... Yes! Blocked off Hulkenberg. Cheeky little... Oh, it's three wide here. Easy on the inside. Easy, easy. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, a bit too close to Raikkonen for my comfort. Okay, he's getting away from us. We're on the outside of Weber. Weber, Weber, Weber. Easy, easy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, I'm being overtaken. It's fine. Oh, I'm being absolutely done. I'm being absolutely done by the AI. Massa! Massa! Again! Oh, we're outside the top 10 now. I have to make an overtake. I have to. Deresta, don't you dare. Okay, good. We're back in P10. This will work for us. I'll just stay here. I'll hold this. Okay, because I'm worried about that red car ahead of us. Felipe Massa has taken us out far too many times. Oh, no. No, no. Durest, if I get done over by Duresta here. Right, out the tunnel. Easy does it. Break there. Oh, God. Oh, slow it down. Oh, good. Thank God. They're fighting behind me. Okay, I just need to get these corners right. Easy. No, no. Every time. Where are you meant to break for there? Okay. Come on, this is the one. We're, we're getting to Tabak consistently now. We just need to work out where to break for Tabak. Clearly, with this handling model on this game, need to break freaking like 100 meters earlier. Oh, no. This is the worst position to... Oh, Massa! Oh. <laughs> Look at that rear wing damage. That's incredible. Bring that, that kind of damage back to the modern game, I say. Look at it. Good start. Where's Kurz? What's Kurz? Is it K? I think it might be K. No, it's not K. Okay, I'm not going to... I was looking at my keyboard there. That could have been a disastrous thing. Looking down rather than up at the screen. Right. We've overtaken Weber this time. I've now got two Ferraris ahead of me. And Alonso. That was close. That was very, very close. Oh, my God. I've been absolutely sent by Weber. And I'm all out of shape. <laughs> oh, big crash. Big crash behind us. Oh, red flag. Oh, there's more crashing going on. I just hear carbon fiber crunching. Okay, surely. Where are we now? From P6, we've got to be doing it now. Just need to break early. Break early for Tabak, man. Break early for Tabak. On the way. Oh, it's a slow start. It's a slow start for Weber. Uh, or oh, Vettel, I should say. It's a slow one for Massa as well. Easy. E oh, come on! All right, it was kind of funny for a little bit, but now I just want to get done. Now, now, I'm, now I'm just, now, now this is just long. It's just long. Underway, going to get to that inside again. Cover off my teammate, Checo Perez. We're now down in P10, so we've lost a position in the grid. Oh, no. Oh, my heads up display's come up. Oh, someone's hit me on the rear. And uh, now my car's... Oh, my God! My car's been destroyed! Right, P10 again, so we're not as high as we were on some of the previous stems, so we've got a bit more work to do to try and stay in the top 10. Grosjean's had an awful start. I want to get ahead of Massa. I want to get ahead of Massa. Oh, oh, okay. That's good. That's good. Oh, squeeze through up to P9. Okay. Just easy. Cover off Massa there. Going to cover off any AI on the inside because, oh, no, they're going around the out. Oh, come on! It's the pressure of them going around the outside knowing that they could hit me. And that's just making me turn more and then into the wall. This is the one. I've decided that this, this is the one. We're going to do it. We're going to get back to Tabak. We're going to take that corner fine. And then we're going to end it off. Oh, that was close. All right, Massa, go through. That's fine. You can be there, mate. I'm P9. I'll hold the P9 here. Easy does it. No, no, do not get to my inside or outside there. Just go. Oh, no, no. Oh, my God. How have we 
managed to avoid that. That was unbelievable. Unbelievable. Red flag. Weber absolutely destroyed ahead of us. Well, how are we only getting to PA? I swear we were higher than that. All right, PA. I'll take it. Okay. On the restart. The red flag. I kind of wish there wasn't a red flag then. Because I would have just carried on. It would have been fine. And now I've got Sutil on my inside. I've got someone on my outside. Oh, no. Please, after all of that, after dodging Weber so well, please don't let me crash again now on Sector 1. Right, Massa, you go through. Oh, I nearly hit the wall there. I really genuinely did. Right, easy, easy, easy. Little bit of throttle needed, just trying to, trying to keep ahead of the cars behind me. Easy, easy, good. Okay, hairpin, going to break now. Good, 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 good. Okay. Okay, I think we can get to Tabak, and then we'll be fine. Okay, just need to break very early. Very, very early, Arav. Okay, good break zone. Lovely. Cut the corner a little bit, just for good, good measure. Right, I'm going to break now. Turn in. Good. Okay, that's so much slower than the modern F1 cars go through there. Okay, easy. Oh, no, it's the old Monaco. Oh, damn it. It's the old Monaco. It's the old, old, old Monaco. It doesn't flow as quickly through there. It's fine, though. Wait. Oh, my God. I thought I hit the wall there. I thought I hit the wall. We're P9. We're good. Just one more corner. Yes. Oh, it nearly was quite embarrassing for me right at the end there. But we've done it. Ten years later, we have re-survived Monaco on F1 2013. And this time, with the added challenge of a keyboard. Guys, if you have enjoyed the video, hit the like button. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. If you're around here, then do get subscribed for weekly Formula 1 content. And let me know if you want to maybe see me revisit other F1 games or F1 2013 again, just different circuits with the Survive series, because I hope it was very clear compared to modern Survive episodes. These older games are so much more chaotic because the AI are just that dumber and just more aggressive. So let me know in the comments below. But till the next one, guys, hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Goodbye.